What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and last time you checked in we had a ton of fun We made it over to Salatian town or city or whatever. Hold on. Let me get my bike out. Get my bike out uh, What I just did I went ahead and did the berries and picked them and planted them before starting recording uh, So that's what we did there. Let me go and get rid of my bike and uh, Someone in the comments said I should go ahead and use a magic carp and so that way we can evolve it to Gyarados That might be a good idea. Let's go in here though really quick and uh, I also caught a Goldeen. I was trying to get a new Magikarp, but it was taking me forever. I just wanted to record this video. If you use Repel, it keeps weak Pokemon away from you. It's useful if you need to get somewhere in a hurry. Good deal. I'm always in a hurry in this game. I want to decorate my ball capsules, but I can't buy any stickers here. Well, I do appreciate your motivation. I don't have the same motivation to decorate my ball capsules. <laughs> just saying. And uh, so yeah, I planted the berries already. And uh, let's go over here. You have your history, and every Pokemon has their own history. When the two collide, new drama is born. He gave me a new app for my watch, which, uh, honestly, if I... When I grow up, I want to work for the Pokemon Nursery. If I just met someone on the street trying to give me an app for my cell phone or something, I would just say no. Every Sunday, I visit the Lost Tower. Cool. So, let's... Do I need to go in here to do this? I don't think I do. I think I can access my box. I don't know. What, what's the story about? I read somewhere that Pokemon grow at different rates. What you read is true. It's a fair distance from Salatian Town to Veilstone City. I suppose you can rest at the cafe, but that place... Please continue. I don't know that place what. So, let me go ahead and uh, access my box here. And uh, to the boxes. Let me switch. Swap this guy with uh, this one. And then, I think M-Dog. I, mean, I think I'm going to get rid of M-Dog. J-Dog's kind of cool. For now, I think I'm gonna switch them. Let's see. Uh, to the boxes. Let's get in this magic carp here that we have. Level 16. That's fine. Uh, I don't think you can rename him. But he can take the place of that, and he'll level up soon enough. Okay, so we'll deal with it. Good, good, good. Let's now venture on. Venture forward. What's up, my dude? Breathing in this refreshing air. It even perks up Pokemon. That's why I'm out here. All right. Good for you. What's up, my dude? Oh, welcome. You saw the notice outside about us hiring, right? Is that a Pokedex there? Then you must know Professor Rowan. You're just the Pokemon searching expert we've been looking for. I want you to bring me a Geodude. You must bring it today or we're not going to be able to run our main article. Remember, it has to be today before the date rolls over. Can I access my bag from here? To the boxes, I mean. I have a Geo dude, right? He's like the first thing I, ca I captured. So move over. Here, yeah, this is what we'll do. We'll switch him over really quick. I'll show him. Here it is. What's up? Did you bring us the Pokemon we needed? Ho ho ho! That's it, Geo dude. Thanks. Let me get a closer look. I see. Mm, right, right. That's it. Thank you. I can write a great article now. This is for your trouble. It's not much, but thanks. I obtained some nest balls. Okay, good. Those capture, uh, I think, bug and. No, those are net balls, right? Whatever. You really came through with us. I hope, I hope you'll help us again. The Sinnoh region's newspaper is tiny, but it has many fans. That newspaper is printed right here. All right, let me go back to my, my boxes then, and we'll switch out, put Magikarp back in. Uh, move over to here. There we go. Someone recommended that I just keep it in my party, and I think it's a good idea. I could I could use a G Dog, but I need to rename him. It's over here. Huh. It's like a maze. How do I get over? I don't know if I can, honestly. Look at this. I don't think I can. I don't get it, my dude. I don't get it at all. I'm the Pokemon Nursery Man. We look after the precious Pokemon of other trainers. If you'd like us to take care of your Pokemon, have a word with my wife. So there's a po why, why would I have him take care of my... Is it breeding? This is... Uh, I don't know. Sup? I'm the Pokemon Nursery Lady. We take care of up to two Pokemon for you. Would you like us to take care of your Pokemon? No. Oh, fine then. Come again. I mean, I guess... I wish you would give me more info. Take care of this thing. Take care of M-Dog. 
And uh, maybe... Maybe Kazaa. Or Ponita. Let's do Kazaa. Alright. It'll cost to leave two Pokemon. It'll cost 1,000 to leave two Pokemon. Okay, I'll take good care of your M Dog. Come back for them later. Okay. See ya. Maybe if I, if I can remember to come back here. I don't know. There's a cloud above me. What's up, girl? Howdy, traveling trainer. There's no gym in this town. You'll be waiting. <laughs> Wanted Veilstone or Pastoria. That's her accent. That's not mine. That's hers. There used to be nothing here but a road that went straight through. Over time, Pokemon and people just gathered and the town came to be. So how a lot of towns are formed. Eventually, you know. All right. Every so often, eggs will be found at the Pokemon nursery and they're found without anyone knowing how they got there. Is someone, oh, so am, am I breeding them? Is someone leaving them there? I don't know. Maybe I'm breeding them. They say no one has ever seen a Pokemon actually lay an egg. So it hasn't been proven that Pokemon actually lay eggs. Huh. Imagine that. I talked to you, right? Yeah, yeah, you're the one who told me about the road. Wait, wait, can I go this way? Aha, this is how you get around. Oh dear, there's like a cave over here. Aw, oh, man, I don't want to go in a cave, do I? I guess I kind of do. Let's go into this cave. Oh, wait, 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 Salation Ruins. Although I'm not ready to go in a cave. I'm ready to finish this up. All right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's, yeah, this is how you get to the house, right? There's two houses. This is how you get to one of them. <laughs> what am I doing in this house? My son just loves those nearby ruins. If you don't mind, can you show him the Pokemon you catch in the ruins? Where's your son? I don't know what's, what you're talking about. Now I gotta go around again. There's a way to get over there, I'm sure of it. Hold on. Little maze-like structure. There you go. All right, uh, hey, howdy cowgirls. Your Pokemon has a, has a serious nature. Did you know that a Pokemon's nature determines how it will grow? There's always been lots of Pokemon in this area, even in the olden days. They say there were big Pokemon ranches around these parts. All right. Let me then, let me get, let me finish up this town as much as I can before we go into the, uh, the cave. I think we are about done. Yeah, this is Route 210. Whoa, dramatic music. Let's go into the ruins then. And let's see what it's all about. Uh, okay. Uh, I cannot read that. Okay, yeah, I, believe you me, I, I don't know that language. I repel. I think I could use one of those, right? What the heck is this place? What's up? There's something really weird about these ruins. That's why I like coming here, but then again, come to my house later. I'll give you a ball capsule if you can, you can so you can play stickers on it. All right, I guess. I mean, do I care? Is this a maze? Dang, I bet we have to fight. This place is teeming with an un un unknown is that there has to be some meaning to this the truth can be found i'll start my search by battling you fine <laughs> let's battle whoa this is a ruined maniac carl <laughs> <He's> just, <laughs> this guy <laughs> this guy's just interested in the ruins and we just call him a maniac this guy's a maniac I'm down here too, but this one, man, maniac. Power punch, let's go. Got him. Super effective, I powered it up. And he fainted. Goodbye to you. 
Uh, Bronzor. No, I, I, I'm i happy with Bronzor. I think. No, I know. Okay, I should have known. I now know what Bronzor is. Uh, but we got a Flame Wheel, which is super effective, so we can just roll over him. I should, yeah, so I would have kept this one anyway. Got him. Super effective. Uh, Geodude, just keep the current one. We know it's gonna work. All right, I'm dozing off, whatever. Stop, stop, stop giving me that info, I don't need that info. Let's do a mock Punch. Got him. All right, you maniac, I beat ya. <laughs> Poor guy. J-Dog leveled up. All right, Ruin Maniac Carl has been defeated. The search must continue. True, true, true. An escape rope could be helpful. I hope there are not that many random encounters in here. Nothing in there. Let's see what we got over here. Is this is is this where I came from? Huh. I don't know where I am, honestly. Down again. Big mushroom. I don't... I'm a little lost already. I should have been paying closer attention to where I am. Oh boy, um... There's up again. Some of this is just nothing. Oh wow, a nugget. Mind plate. There is text engraved on the back of the obtained plate. The power of defeated giants infuses this plate. You put the mind, okay, I got a mind plate. Odd incense. A rare candy. And uh, I can't read that. <laughs> so that's cool. I find them. I found the mind plate. Now I gotta get out of here. They did give me an escape rope. Have I gone this way? I think I can't. I got what I came here for. I give up, I'm not going to rack my brain over the meaning of this place. I guess I fought, that's the guy I fought already, right? Dude, I am so lost. Been going up this whole time, I think. This is where we started, right? Yeah, okay. So I can go back in. Let's think about this. There's gotta be a map. I should just pull up a map. I <laughs> should just find the map of this place. All right, so, have we been this way? Yes, so right is the only way to go. Okay, so from here, we have up again. Okay, so that's, that's another, so then two paths here, left or down, or left or right. So that we've gone left, let me go right really quick. Okay, so yeah, left is the only way to go. All right, so then then once we're here, keep in mind this is the only way. We have uh, three paths. Let's go with the let's go up here. All right, hold on. That's one way to go. Okay, I'm glad that's dead end. So there's uh there's one way over here. Okay, good. So that's again once more the only way to go. So then we're stuck with uh, two paths. This way is is one way to go. Let me go. I mean, so that's one. This is a dead end. Good, 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 good. So we, I think we've explored this the correct way. So once more, we have a couple places to go. This one is oh, okay. Hold on, hold on. That seems to be the right way to go. But let me just check over here. 
dead end good. Is this one a dead end too? Okay, great. I'm pretty sure I got what I came here for. So then we're over here. Yeah, dead end good. And then we got this room, which is, yeah, we, we got this room for sure. Yeah, I think we fully explored this. This is the, like, maybe the only other place we haven't been. Yeah. Great. Great, great, great. Great, great, great. Wonderful. So we know that if it leads to... Uh, wrong way. I'm already lost again. We know if it leads to a certain room... Like, like if it leads to a room with multiple choices, then we're on the right path. Because every other room option is a dead end. Uh, right. Okay. Cool. Oh yeah, that guy wanted me to come back to the place or whatever. Which means me going this way really quick to talk to that woman again. I think she said to show me, like, this is his house, right? He told me to come back here. I'm researching unknown. Unknown has a lot of different forms. Fascinating, isn't it? I'd love for you to show me. I don't have it. What? How do I get... I didn't catch anything in the ruins. How do you get unknown? Okay, hold on. This is this is going to be a big question for me then because I thought that we were going to slash in ruins. How do you get unknown? Uh I don't know, man. I'm looking at it. Do I need to maybe I have like the repel? Maybe that's the thing. Maybe, because I am, I kind of have this repel thing going on, right? So let me, maybe that's the issue. Uh, swap held items. Okay, hold on. This is not how you do it. Hold on, bag. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Shell bell. Yeah, maybe what had happened is I was... Okay, so now... Okay. Let's go back. Maybe maybe I didn't see anything because of that. I don't know. Oh, dang it. I messed up. I'm going to go all the way. I need to do a little more research on the unknown or whatever, you, however you call it. <laughs> unknown seems like an adequate name for it, right? Let's see. Let me let me just look at something really quick here. Because um, I did get the mine plate. Which is good. Um, unknown. Let's see. Trying to find an article about unknown. Uh, unknown Pokemon. Sorry, I'm looking up something really quick. Unknown psychic type Pokemon. Uh, derivative shapes. What? Has different shapes? Is there anything that we can do about it? Uh, I'm having a hard time understanding. Let me just walk through this area. Maybe I'll find them. I don't know. Like, because I had basically repel on, essentially, right? I don't know how to find the unknown. Um, maybe this isn't going to work out for me. <laughs> maybe, maybe this isn't what I thought it was. Uh, let's see. I'm 
I'm trying to I'm trying to read about this again. I'm sorry. I should. Uh, there's more than there's. No, he's only. Huh. I don't. Uh, I don't know how you get the Pokemon in here. Okay, I'm gonna do some research. I'll be right back. Okay, as far as I know, I just need to just keep going. I looked it up. It just says, just like, keep going to different spots and you'll eventually encounter one. And I took off the thing that acts as a repel, right? I mean, I, I think I did. So I should eventually run into it, I think. And if I'm doing something wrong, let me know. I'm not seeing one at all. I thought that I would still have a chance of running into stuff. I'm just not running into it. I don't understand. Cause I've already been all throughout this. I'm not, I don't have the repel thing on anymore. I'm super confused. I would like to catch one and give it to the boy. But if it's not gonna happen, I mean, it's not gonna happen, I guess. I don't know what this stuff is. Yeah, do I, maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just not smart. <laughs> I, I read, I, I don't know. Maybe I need to just do even more research. I, I, it said it was in here. It said you would just run into one, right? I need to do some more research. Bear right back. Okay, guys, I got one. I just was running around and finally got one. So there's a whole bunch of different forms of these, and if you catch like all the forms in like the Pokemon Maniac or the Ruins Maniac will give you like a location to even more. I don't know if that's for me. Let's do a mock punch. Let's see what happens here. Okay, that's not bad. Not very effective, good, because I want to capture him. So this is an unknown. Let's get him again one more time with the mock punch. Good, okay, I'm gonna try to capture him now. And then I'll put on I'll put on my uh, you know my thing that repels again. Not very effective. So you know I I bought some Pokemon balls before recording this. So there we go. Please capture him. I gotta show the boy. Got him. All right, let's get out of here. Honestly, the quickest way to get out of here will be to use an escape rope. All right, cool. Because the Pokemon is shaped like ancient writing, it is a huge mystery whether uh, written language or unknown came first. Well, probably this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, send it to, actually, I guess I would send it to my party for now so I could show the boy and then I will end up putting it in the, yeah. Right, okay, got it. Got it, got it, got it. Now let me just, uh, we're gonna go back into my items. And I do do really like the uh, cleanse tag. Honestly, I do. Where'd it go? Oh yeah, over here. Dang it! Come on. Let's give the mind plate to uh, J Dog here. What's the odd instant psychic type moves? All right, cool. Uh, let's get out of here then. And then um, let's go talk to the boy. It's quite the adventure trying to get one of those, huh? And then I guess we'll go up on another route. Probably end up battling a bunch more people on the way to the next town. Let's see what he gives me for showing him this. I'm researching unknown. Unknown have a lot of different forms. Uh, yeah, here we go. I got one. There's there's mine. Oh, I could have kept it in the box. Wow, I've never seen that form of unknown before. Please take this ball capsule as my thanks. All right, great. 
Was it worth it? If you find a different form, please show it to me. I'm not gonna go. Yeah, so I'm not gonna find a different form. I just. <laughs> let's go, let's send it to the boxes. Let's bring back in Magikarp. There we go. There we go. So yeah, let's uh, let's let's now we're gonna go over here. I think route two ten. Bunch of berries over here. Ass pear berries. Got some more ass pear berries. And then uh, what's over here? Panat berries. Uh, raspberries. Okay, yes. And since I'm basically a farmer in this game, I'm going to go ahead and plant some more, including the persim. Uh, let's do. Let's do an ass pear. Let's do a... Rostberry. Let's do a... Blackberry. And then let's, last but not least, let's do a... Uh, Leopard berry, there we go. Now we're gonna water these. This berry farming stuff takes me forever, apparently. All right. Now, dang. All right, Ponita, I don't care. I'm gonna run away. I already have one. Run. Uh, what's up, farmer dude? My Pokemon toughen up from working on the ranch. I'm right proud of them. Good for you. Good for you for being right proud. Challenge by Rancher Marco. Polo! Hi, Pom. All right, don't worry, we're gonna beat him down. That's a monkey thing, I'm a monkey thing. Monkey versus monkey, but my tail's on fire. Your tail's a hand. That's a little worrisome. Let's do a power-up punch. Yep, goodbye. Does he have three, is that how many he has? I think he has three, right? Psyduck, let's just keep the current Pokemon, I think. Cloud nine, the effects of the weather disappeared. Okay, I was real worried about that. Another power up punch. Nice. And then I dog leveled up. Gear for rig. Uh, let's get. I don't know what a gear for rig is. Let's see what it is. <laughs> Gir giraffe. <laughs> Girafrig, I think is how you would say it. What the heck, dude? Let's do a power punch. I don't know, man. This thing looks punchable. Yeah, he's he's gone. <laughs> oh man. Magikarp and Star Staravia leveled up. Aerial Ace. Let's let's forget an old move and let's learn Aerial Ace. Sounds awesome. It says 60 never misses. What? It's like the same thing. I don't understand what. This looks like the same thing. Hold on, this is another thing I feel like I should just Google, like wing attack versus aerial ace. Like, let's see. Wing attack versus, that's one of the top Google searches. So. 
Uh, let's see. Huh. So if there's anything that tries to dodge, I guess, area, so let's just forget wing attack. Sure, there you go, whatever, I don't care. I was reading something about, you know, AI using dodging and stuff, I don't know, man. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at what we got next, ta-da, good. Good job. Magikarp also leveled up. And we are out of here, Rancher Marco is gone. Your Pokemon sure can be counted on. Indeed, they can be. Uh, let me get out of here. Let me go up here. Uh, bring my bike. Wrong button. Sup, dude? I'm going to keep running just as long as there's a road. So, let's see here. Oh, I can't ride in the grass. That's fine. I'm taking a rest. If I were a bird Pokemon, it would be a roost. Uh, you should rest up too. Thanks, I got some TMs. Some creepy twins over there. If they had to keep flying forever, bird Pokemon would eventually crash. <laughs> Move. I can't ride through the tall grasses. Hilarious. They, they're gonna wanna battle me, of course. I can get away with slacking off if I have my Pokemon out. Oh ho ho, I'll show you all how tightly I bonded with my daughter. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Ava and Madsen on Stunky and Glamiao. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Let's fight. <laughs> All right, the opposing Stunky's attack fell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Staravia. I dog wants to be pet. Whatever, dude. Super effective power up punch going on Glamiao, and we got an effective new aerial ace. Let's just target Glamiao just to finish him off. But I'm pretty sure this will finish him off. Yep. So we're gonna go ahead and go after the skunk thing now. Skunk with the butt for a face. All right. Aerial Ace, get ready. Oh, that did not do the job. Acid Spray, no! Am I gonna be poisoned? Dang it, no, no, I don't think so. My special defense fell, that's okay. I'm gonna do a mock punch since it's the fastest. We're gonna continue doing an Aerial Ace. Got him. Stunky fainted. All right, Ranchers, Ava, and Matt. Oh, sheesh. <laughs> <laughs> Sheesh! <laughs> Parent and child power couldn't get the job done. You're weird, man. Uh, let's let's try to go up over here then. Uh, I guess I can't. So we'll just walk through. Dang it! All right, another ponyta. Okay, I don't care. I don't want to do it. Run. There we go. All right. Hello. Yay, we're gonna battle with lots of Pokemon. Yay, we're gonna have a battle with three trainers. I don't want too many Pokemon here. Okay, we're good. The twins here, Terry and Tia, Pikachu and Clefairy. Here we go. And yeah, yeah, lower their attacks. I like that. I'm gonna attack Pikachu first because I'm afraid he'll paralyze me, honestly. Let's do a power up punch on Pikachu. And let's do a quick attack on Pikachu as well. Should take him out pretty quick, I imagine. Oh, there's a static. Dang it, dude. Sorry. Don't hit me, though. 
All right. Dang it, both of us. Son of a gun, dude. Are you kidding me? Uh, sure. I guess I'll just have them both, both fight. And we're both paralyzed, we're both paralyzed, whatever. There you go, that worked. Okay, okay, that worked. Too bad we're both paralyzed though, that's ridiculous. I don't even know if I have two paralysis heals. We couldn't win. Even with both of us, we lost. Indeed you did. Let's go in my bag. Maybe do I have any paralyzed heals? Some of the sound effects are not. All right. Hey, check this out. Look at the luster of my Pokemon's fur. All right, I'll take a look. He's got three Pokemon. Two of my dudes are paralyzed. Pichu, let's see what we got. I'm a little worried though. I'll try to do whatever we can here. Okay, I pulled it off. Excellent. So Pichu's gone. Some of the sound effects are not playing. Uh, let's switch Pokemon, maybe. Who's coming out? Let's bring out Machop. Pikachu, oh god, am I gonna get like a third one paralyzed? Come on. Low sweep. Let's do revenge. Dang, that was not an attack. Got it. Let's keep the current Pokemon. Who is this sending out? Happening? Weird. Do knock off. <laughs> All right, crush its brains. Let's go. Machop leveled up. And Kahil. Hey, hey, did you take take a good look? I wasn't looking at the fur. I forgot. I was just looking through ugly faces. What? Machop is evolving. Here we go. Getting bigger. Let's go. Yes. You guys a beast. Your Machop evolved into Machoke. There you go. Machoke's data will be added to the Pokedex. Machoke's boundless power is very dangerous. So it wears a belt that suppresses its energy. No, let take the belt off. I, I want to go full energy. Energy, whatever. Oh, is I dog? What? You're changing a Hanab berry. Okay, thank you for getting that berry for me. I'm trying to get this great ball. All right. Whoa, I hopped over. What's up? I'm a rookie breeder, but I'll do my very best. Just a bucket full of balls. With three Pokemon, okay. Kleffa. Oh man, I forgot about switching my Pokemon again. I need to get my Pokemon a rest. Let's try this. I'm par I know I'm paralyzed. Dang it, dude. This stuff doesn't wear off, does it? Uh, let's switch Pokemon. A much choke. Take your belt off. Big boy. Disarming voice. Ouch. Super effective against me. Did what the? 
All right, we'll switch Pokemon again. Let's bring out Onix. Wait, wait, hold on. Dang it, I didn't. <laughs> hold on. There we go. Hi. Disarming voice again. Ouch. Uh, rock slide. Let's do it. Yes. Onyx leveled up. Clefairy. No, just keep the current Pokemon, I think. It's another rock slide. Nah, dang. Alright, Copycat. Use the same. What? What does this. What does Copycat do? Rock slide against me? Come on, that doesn't do anything. Why would you do that? Don't be dumb. Let me look at the moves. This is 75, this is 50. Let's do it with the SmackDown so that we're sure to hit. Gotcha, Clefairy. All right. Uh, happening. Just keep the current Pokemon, I think. I've met Happening before. And uh, let's do the Rock Slide again. Hopefully it hits. There we go. There we go. All right, Amber. It's all right, I'm still a rookie. All right. And then, uh, what is this? Whoa, a whole bunch of Psyducks up here. The heck, the Psyducks are standing firm. They aren't inclined to move at all. All right. <laughs> Cafe Cabin, farm fresh milk. Can I rest here? Because I need to rest. Sup? Welcome, this Pokemon is my pride and joy. Oh, we're fighting, okay. <laughs> all right, she's serving up a dish. And it is Clefairy, okay, great. Let's battle it out then. No, Idog's paralyzed. Dang it. Keep forgetting to switch him. I keep hoping to find. Let's do uh, Flame Wheel. Okay, it's gonna work. A little bit. Sweet Kias. Thank you for the Kias. Graham confused. Oh, you know, I'm just gonna switch him out. I got two things not going for me. Onyx will be probably pretty good. All right, hang in there, Onyx. Oh yeah. Charm. All right. Uh, battle, uh, rock slide, please hit. No, I should have used the other one. Overkill, but it works. Well, there we go. Waitress Katie. I take losses with an unusually big smile. Do you find that odd at all? I don't know. I'm a collector and I'm proud of what I know about Pokemon. Would you like me to test your knowledge? Dang it, they're bad. I, uh, another battle. He has three Pokemon. I gotta freaking switch these out. Pseudo Wudo. Pseudo Wudo. Pseudo Wudo. Pseudo Wudo. Alright, now, honestly, I would love to hit him with the fire, but I'm paralyzed. Let's just try it anyway. It worked. That wasn't even. What? What? I thought he was like a. He could burn down. What is this guy? Hammer arm. What the freaking. That was big. Okay. Uh, let's switch Pokemon, I guess. To Machoke. And uh, let's see what we got. Here we go. Hammer arm again. Big stuff. Big stuff happening. 
Not sleepy. Let's do a uh, let's do a re revenge. What? Uh, I'm, I don't want to escape. I want my revenge. Super effective. Nice J Dog and Magic Carp leveled up. Love it. Keep the current Pokemon. We know what works. And then we're gonna do. Re Let's do low sweep. Boom! Goodbye. Super effective as well. Eye Dog and Staravia. Yeah, you're just doing the same thing over and over. Let's make this work. Battle it out. Low sweep. Do I gotta fight all these guys? I don't know. I don't know. I'm in the cafe just fighting things. It's a cafe brawl. Collector Edwin. That's some knowledge you have there. True it is. True it is. Do they all want to fight me though? That's the question. And if so... Let me switch my Pokemon up so that we have people who aren't paralyzed up in the front. So we were having a heated discussion over Pokemon the way collectors do. Well, I guess we're gonna have a heated battle then. He's got three as well. Fernando, Mr. Mime. All right, let's do this. Let's do a low sweep, I guess. I don't know. Mm. Not very effective, unfortunately. Encore. All eyes on me. A choke must do an encore. Does that mean I have to do low sweep again? Probably. Let's try knockoff, though. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna choke. I only use low sweep. I get it. So I used the wrong thing, and thus he wants to see that again. That's okay. I'll hit you again. Even if it's not very effective, I'll keep doing it. Have me do the encore, whatever. Power swap. There you go. There you go. Let's try knock off. Oh, I can, don't, I can still only use low sweep. Okay. It's fine. There you go. Power, so you get, just do what do what you do. You're gonna, just gonna get low sweep to death. Don't worry. Here we go. Not very effective, Mr. Mime fainted. And then uh, my encore ended thankfully because he's gonna send out another Mr. Mime. Let's what? what no, ah, dang it. All right, uh, let's try knockoff then. See how this goes. Ha <laughs> ha! Even better. All right. Machoke grew to level twenty-nine. And he's gonna send another Mr. Mime. Let's just keep the current Pokemon. I'm happy with the way that this has been working, relatively speaking. Knock off. All right, let's do it one more time, please. Oh, okay, well, yeah, yeah sure. I'll do, I'll, I, I have no problem doing that as an encore. Mr. Mime, goodbye. And this collector, what was his name again? This collector is... Magikarp and, and Onyx crew. Collector Fernando. Knowledge alone isn't everything you know. True, I got the street smarts, or whatever, street toughness, the experience in battle. Oh, there we go, what? Magikarp is evolving. We knew it. We knew this would happen. That's the whole point of today's episode, basically. 
and we got Gyarados. Super cool. Your magic carp evolved into Gyarados. Gy Gy Gyarados, I don't know. Once Gyarados appears, its rage never settles until the Pokemon has raised the fields and mountains around it. Bite. All right. Uh, do you also want to battle? Youngster, you've seen the Psyduck huddled outside. Psyduck are Pokemon that suffer from chronic headaches. I'm afraid we'll have to wait for them to get better. Howdy, Traveler. Some of our customers are rowdy types that want to battle, but pay no mind and stay a while. How are you doing? What you have? Of course, all we have here is Moo Moo Milk. Moo Moo Milk, want a bottle? I'll buy one. Why not? Here's your Moo Moo Milk. Enjoy. Don't know what it does. I don't know what Moo Moo Milk does. <laughs> I don't know. Let me look it up. Does it give... What does it do? Bag. Moo Moo Milk. Uh, okay, a bunch of HP. It's not bad. Just to wait for those guys to leave, I guess. Oh, it's raining now? We're at 215. You know what? Maybe I can just leave. Maybe I can go ahead and heal my... What do you think? Do you think I can just go heal? I'm gonna go ahead and heal everybody. That makes the most sense to me. I keep forgetting, like, it feels like a long way away, but it's not to go to the next town ever. You know what I mean? So let's go heal and uh, let's see what we got going on. As we go through the next route, route, whatever you want to say. Go ahead and put them all in. Just don't want to face off against any more Pikachus. All right, great. All right. That seemed worth it, right? Maybe? Wrong button. Still. Let's go. Can't hop over that, that's okay. Can't do anything with bikes. You can do some things with bikes. I knew he'd want to fight me. I'm a treasure hunter. Today the loot is a victory from you. We'll see about that. Ruin Maniac Calvin. Bronzor. Hi, dog. There we go. It's raining. Let's battle. Let's do a flame wheel that's super effective. Thankfully, the rain doesn't put out my fire. Critical hit on top of it. Good job. All right. Um, about Shielden. I don't think I. I don't think I fought a Shielden, have I? Oh wow! Is it the same thing? Like the f the fire will work? Let's see. Oof. Use taunt. Oh, I'm mad. Let's see how this goes. Ha! Super effective. You would think the shield would help against my fist, but no. All right, that's a ruined maniac right there. I can't win. You're too much to take. And then uh, an ether. I slow down and stop at times, sure. I'm only human after all. Oh, my dog is looking around and searching for something. Do unto others as they do unto you. Yep, it's payback. It's good for Pokemon battles, but if you do that in real life, there'll be no end to the fighting, that's for sure. You obtain TM66s. You put the TM66s in your bag's TM pockets. Use it after the opponent and its power gets doubled. Uh, 
All right. Does this guy want to fight? Check the sharpness of my fighting type Pokemon's moves. All right. He's only got one. Crow Gunk. Let's do it. Let's do a power punch. I mean, I'm sure, you know, we're both fighting, I guess. He's gonna do sucker punch. Not very effective, I know, but I wanna power up, up myself. Eh, it's not too bad. Let's do it again. Yeah, that's good. Not very effective, but we're, we're making progress. All right. Here we go with a mock punch. There you go. Okay. Believe me, I'm very happy with that. That was a good move on my part. You've dulled its sharpness. That's okay. That's okay. Was there anything down here? Something over here. Cut this with a uh, move. But Doof just does everything for me, I guess. He wants to fight. I was snoozing, you claim. I merely feigned sleep. Hiya! All right, let's see. He's got three of them. Black Belt Gregory. Going to send out immediate Metatite. Let's see what we got here. I'm a monkey as well. Come on, I dog. We got this. What's up, dude? It's raining, isn't it? I'm dozing off. Well, we got Flame Wheel. Let's do that really quick and see how much that gets us to detect. All right, he protected himself. Here comes Flame Wheel regardless. Or not. <laughs> or not Flame Wheel again. You're killing me, dude. All right, fine. Ember. There you go, sure. Flame wheel. I gotta go first this time. Nice. Side beam. Oof. Oof. That was heavy one. Super effective, huh? Stu it says mock punch not very effective, but it goes first. He has little HP, so let's... Well, I thought I go first. What the... <laughs> I don't get it. Goodness, what a battle, huh? Are we sending out this time another yeah, let's switch Pokemon? Let's try uh let's try this, I guess. I don't know. Go Onyx! There we go. Ah, oh, dang. Dragon Breath is effective, I guess. But is it really? Not really. Ow. Super effective. Dang it! Paralyzed too? Alright, let's switch Pokemon. Let's do... Oh, yeah. Star with the area. Yeah, there you go. Aerial, Aerial Ace will work really well with this. And his attack fell. Alright, Aerial Ace. Here we go. Dope. We got him. Let's keep the current Pokemon. The chop's coming out, I guess. He's cute. Aerial Ace, though, watch out. <laughs> Alright, great. We got him. We get to pick up a ball over here. 
gurgle. <laughs> what? A fist plate, nice. Two beings of time and space set free from the original one. You put the fist plate in your bag's other pocket items. It's another thing to chop down over here, I guess. Oh, there's a couple berries. Let's go and pick them. Does the rain water the ground, or do I actually have to water it? I don't know. Let's plant some new berries. Persim berry. I might have to water it anyway. The game may not know. Ross berry, there you go. Go ahead and sprinkle some water. There we go. I don't know if the rain would have done the trick, but you know. A guard spec. I'm not sure what that is, but I'll take it. And then here's another tree to cut down. Oh, he sees me. Every drop of sweat I shed makes me that much stronger. Let's see it. Black Belt Nathaniel. Crow Gunk. Alright, we got this. We got this. It's raining. Let's battle then. Flame Wheel coming at ya. I'm glad the rain does not put this out. Ah, uh, I got him in one hit. I don't know how many Pokemon this guy has. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, let's see. Does flying do? Here, let's let's switch. This might work. I don't know. So many people to fight on these uh, trails here. Uh, yeah, Aerial Ace will work just fine. Gosh, super strong. Super effective. Uh, just keep the current Pokemon because we, the Aerial Ace did great. Here we go. Nice. Oh, and Gyarados leveled up as well. And learned to, finally learned a water move. Beat ya! I didn't even read what he said. All right. Let's cut this thing down. Shockwave. I don't know if there's anything up here. Looks like there might be. We got random encounters. Don't forget about those. I fought this thing before. Cricket Tune. I hear that tune you're playing, Cricket Tune. Uh, let's see. Let's just do the flame wheel. Got him. No need to capture him. I've already caught him before. J Dog leveled up. And then, uh. Oh, there wasn't anything over here at all. Oh, God. Uh, let's, let's leave. Jogging is good for you, but you have to make sure you're not overdoing it. Thank you. Thank you for that. A full heal, okay. Oh, that guy blended in with the green. I'll battle anyone. That's how I'll get better. I'm taking the Veilstone Gym Challenge, but first... But first, you're coming after me, right? 
Oh, there's two people. What? I didn't see two people. Dennis, what? All right. I did not see. Oh, they got a Monferno too. Okay. I think I know how to spread this out. It's raining, and then the Intimidates kick in as well. Oh wow. So many, too many messages here. Let's do a super effective power punch on Glimmeow. And then let's do the uh, super effective aerial ace on Monferno. <laughs> Cats versus birds, man, you know what? Boom, monkey versus cat. Super effective. All right, here we go. Oh, little kitty cat. Saravia leveled up. Oh wait, Saravia flinched? What the? F no, stop. Stop. All right. Oh, they got another one, Kadabra. Oh boy, big old butt. Uh, let's do, which one's effective? Dang, dude, uh, let's just hit, hit him then. Super effective. I don't know, man. Here we go. Power punch. Okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. I, I need probably to heal him. Watch him get hit this next turn and just faint. All right, I dog grew. Uh, side beam. Yep. I knew it. I just, I freaking knew it. Yeah, I know, you fainted. Uh, what am I doing here? Why did they bring him out when he gets a psychic? I don't know. I'm dumb. Hey, there's, I have one of those. Gosh, you intimidate. Uh, let's see what we got. Dang it, dude. Super effective, knock out, super effective against uh, Kadabra. That works. And an aerial ace effective against Gyarados, I guess. All right, all right. Uh, I knew that would be bad. What? I'm still alive. Just petted him on his little head. A couple of my guys are fainting. Not good. Not good at all. There you go, leveled up, but choke leveled up. Uh, let's do the knockoff on you. Actually, you know what? We should do. We should just do a potion. I don't want him to faint. Let's do a super potion on Machoke, and then let's do a potion on Machoke. Probably, I don't know. There you go, regular potion. Then don't forget your super potion too. Actually, we're probably gonna just use one or the other, right? I don't know. No, no, we're good. Here comes Waterfall again towards... Dang it, dude. Steamrolling me with that. Let's, uh... Let's battle... Knock off. And let's do a quick attack. Okay. Another Waterfall? Jeez Louise, one HP left. Okay, we're gonna want to, uh, let's just do the, uh, let's just do the, well, no, let's go ahead and heal him. Super potion for you, and then you're gonna use a quick attack, because it's gonna be quick and effective, right? Tell me it's effective. Either way, they get a super potion. And then here's the quick attack. Got him. All right. Let's learn the move Sand Tomb. Let's see what we got. It's a ground move, so we don't have a ground move already. 3585. Four to five turns. Dude, it's, oh man, I don't know, Curse? Let's give it a curse. 
I think. Should I look? Let me let me just double check what Curse does on, on, in Pokemon games. I don't remember. Curse Pokemon. Uh, Non-damaging. Ghost type move. Will lose half its maximum HP and put the curse on the target. So it puts a curse on the target. I don't want to. I don't care about the curse on. The, let's just forget that. There you go. That's fine. Ta-da! So there we go, Onyx. There you go. All right, you won and I lost, but both of us gained something from this. You made me lose my confidence. That's funny. Okay, so we're moving on, right? Right, I think so. Get some Mago Berries. I don't think I've had Mago Berries before. And then this is uh, Wiki Berries. I think these are both brand new to me. New type of berries. I guess I'll plant them. Give back to the earth, right? Uh, Habab. Actually, no. The, the, the lighting just changed in this game. <laughs> let's plant a uh, wiki berry. Then let's water it ourselves. All right, we done, we done. All happy, they say. And looks like we're about to approach the next area, I think. Sup, dude? I wanted to go to Celestic Town, but there are some Pokemon in the way. Don't tell me there are Pokemon in the way. We're at Veilstone City! So. Looks, a little, looks pretty cool, right? We'll visit this place tomorrow. Come back next time for that. I'll see you then. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.